Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to transfer stories or transfer updates. There's a few updates in today's video. I'm going to talk about the Leroy Sane move to Bayern Munich and what that could possibly do for him. I'm going to talk about Jaden Sancho's situation at Man United and I'm going to talk about the Henry Mkhitaryan loan extension at Rome. But anyway, there's a lot to talk about, so guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is the Leroy Sane. Last night, he signed a five-year contract with Bayern Munich. He's 24 years old, so, you know, with the likes of 24-year-old guns to Bayern Munich, I can only see one thing for him back in Germany. I am quite sad to see Leroy go. Not because of, you know, the players that City have got, but what he actually brought to City. Don't forget they signed him way back in 2016. So with the likes of him doing that, and having basically four years at the club, and then going back to Germany, eh, I hope we do see Leroy back in the Premier League at some point. But as I said, signed a five-year contract with him, which will roughly see him round about... Bayern Munich to he's about 29 if he sees out his contract. There's about 10 million more pounds worth of add-ons as well for Bayern Munich to play. So, you know, the main bid was around about 45 million and 10 million plus maybe a bit more for add-ons. It will be a bit more for Bayern Munich to pay, which, you know, fair play to Man City for sending them for that price. While we're on the third of this story, I've got to say fair play for Leroy to say to the big bosses up at Bayern Munich or his agents, and he ain't got to sign a new contract, you either let him go or he goes on a freebie in six months. You know, fair play for Leroy, you know, standing up for City and for standing up what he believes in. But, you know, for him going back to, Bayern, uh, going to Germany, he, he can, I can only see positive for Leroy. German football, international call-ups, you know, all these kind of things. I think, you know, I will be watching Bundesliga to actually see him in a bomb unit shirt in his home country. I can only see positives for Leroy. What I've just said, virtually five-year contract. Around about 20, uh, be right to the age of 29. But Man City did sign him back in 2016 for around about 37 million, so they are getting a big profit for selling him to Bayern Munich. But I am going to miss him, and I've said that more than once. But you know, we do lose a lot of our skilled players to clubs abroad, which is a bit of a shame. But you know, our game not really skill, is it? More. Um, more running about and stuff like that, which are a bit unfortunate, but... Right, now going on to the Jaden Sancho story. Man United will not pay more than £70 million pounds for Jaden. This is if all reports are correct, by the way. Um, but, Jaden, £70 million. I mean, really? I mean, you've got the likes of... You couldn't even sign Man Rooney back for that back in the day. You can't even sign Ronaldo for that. I mean, I've seen Jaden play for Bristol Dortmund. I've seen him play for England. I I reckon he's worth around about 150 billion. But that's just my opinion. Obviously, put your opinions down below in the comments. Let me know what you think of this story. One of the, one of you, uh, one of my subscribers did ask me, do I see him going to City? After seeing this story, and if all rumours are true, yes. So this will possibly pop back up again sometime, you know, while the transfer window is open. Only one way you can keep up to date is by subscribing to my channel and hitting your notification bell so you never miss an upload. But, 70 million. I mean, as I said, you can't even get Ronaldo for that. You can't even get Messi for that price, really. Speaking of Messi, 
where do you think he's going to end up? That's my question to you guys. Where do you think Messi will end up this season? Um, but yeah, shot by United if that's true. There's no way you'll get him in the United shirt for that. I know that could be harsh on United. I know obviously we're all like the Cubs are struggling. But you can't get a player like Jaden for 70 million. I'm sorry, but I reckon he'll end up at City or maybe Liverpool. Henry McTorian. Now, he's extended his loan move at Rome, which is fair enough. Have we seen him for the last time in the Premier League and also in an Arsenal shirt? Now, with the likes of when he came to United, because that was his first stop at United, I think that you know he fit in quite well. I think you know he had the odd standout performance. You know he you know he was on the pitch. Then he went over to Arsenal, which Arsenal for you know when they did sign him, I think he struggled to fit in with Arsenal. Now don't, I know I've gone down downhill as well, but I think he really did struggle to fit in with us. I don't know why, but, you know, if he was in the starting 11, he barely really knew he was there, if you know what I mean. With Henry McTorian standing his own move to Rome, He's 31, so time this line comes to an end, he could be 32 years of age. But, you know, I feel sorry for Mkhitaryan because of the lights of, you know, him coming to England. Yet again, this brings you back to, like, when Fel Cow and that comes over, right? You know, they think they could do it, but they can't. You know, I don't know what it is with the English game, but Henry McIntyre has extended his move to Roma. So, obviously I'm not sure how Roma are doing in the table either. But, you know, probably won't see Henry McIntyre again. And Jayden Sancho's, uh, if that report's true, then uh, I'd roughly see Jayden in a City shirt. Which then obviously there'll be an update. And Leroy Sane has signed a five year contract for Bar Munich. Well, there you go, three players on stage, transfer stories, transfer updates, whatever you want to call it. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. Give us a big fat fun, hope you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.